Streets of D.C. Yeah. and this D.C. area treasured event. Who's ready to see some eating going on? Yeah. Don't forget, Seaburger is giving away burgers up until 2 p.m. for everybody that's out here today. You don't have to wait till 2 to eat, but you can eat as soon as the contest is over. We'll let you know when you can go inside. And before we get underway, we'd like to introduce to you the founder and owner of Z-Burger and our new My Own Pizza in Monomon June, Fisher Peter Tabibian. There's no greater tradition to celebrate America's birthday than the good, good old-fashioned hamburger eating contest. And no place to hold it better than nation's capital at Z-Burger, home of the world's greatest burgers. Everybody gets free burgers after the contest. Every year, this contest gets bigger and better. Nathan, watch out. We're coming after you. Then some fighting words from Peter Tabibian this year. Watch out. He is coming after you. Before we bring out our contestants, we're going to break down how the contest works. In just a few minutes, we'll get this competition started. We'll start the clock at 10 minutes. And each of our contestants will try to consume as many hamburgers as possible within the 10 minute period. Whoever consumes the most burgers without regurgitating wins the grand prize. It's going to be an exciting event today, folks. And yes, I did say regurgitating on a microphone. It can happen. And now, ladies and gentlemen, it's time to meet our competitors of the 12th Annual Z-Burger Independence Burger Eating Championship. Our first contestant, well, he lives here in Tenley Town with his wife, Josie, and dog, Archie. Originally from Tulsa, Oklahoma, he came to D.C. to attend American University and now works at a local nonprofit. In his free time, he enjoys karaoke, bar trivia, and walking his dog around the neighborhood. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Alex Prescott. Our next competitor currently resides in Oxon Hill, Maryland, via Washington, D.C., and has competed in numerous local competitions. At the H Street Festival, he participated in the Half Smoke Eating Contest and took second place for the first year he competed. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Terrence Brown. Contestants, remember, wave to the crowd. They are cheering for you to eat a lot of burgers today. Our next contestant is 36 years old from Westchester, Pennsylvania. His favorite food is carbs, and his hobbies include motorcycles, hiking, and long walks to the refrigerator. Let's welcome Dan Ross. Can you smell what The Rock's been cooking? It had to be said, Dan, sorry. Up next is a 29-year-old from Phoenixville, Pennsylvania. His first eating contest was in 2019, in which he won the Kennywood Fourth of July hot dog eating contest, eating 20 hot dogs. Say hi to Sean the Mouthpiece Jager. Our next eater is coming to us by, by way of Shippenville, Pennsylvania, and he recently won the Texas Hot Dog Eating Contest with 33 hot dogs in eight minutes. Last year, he took third place in the Z-Burger Contest, eating 25 burgers. Please welcome back to our nation's capital, Andrew Paul. Our next contestant makes the 12th annual Z-Burger Independence Burger Eating Championship an international event from Brasilia, Brazil, where he is the number one competitive eater in Brazil. He has over 2 million subscribers on his YouTube channel, Corpucci Eats, and is coming to the Z-Burger contest for the first time. Let's give him a warm USA welcome to Ricardo Corpucci! Our next competitor is from West Decatur, Pennsylvania, and is the number four ranked competitive eater in the world. It sounds like they like to eat in Pennsylvania. He is the winner of numerous eating challenges and competitions and is quickly becoming a Z-Burger fan favorite. Last year, he came in second place eating a whopping 34 burgers in 10 minutes. Let's hear it for Dan Killer Kennedy. And 
finally, ladies and gentlemen, our final competitor. We welcome back our 2020 Z-Burger Independence Burger Eating Champion. She may seem dainty, but she is the number one competitive eater in the world. When asked about herself, all she said was, I've been told I eat a lot. She's a lady of few words, but a lot of burgers. She's won multiple eating competitions just this year alone and is the sixth time reigning Z-Burger Independence Burger Eating Champion. The mother of four lives in Maryland, and she is taking the competitive eating world by storm. She's ready to take on the Z-Burger competition all over again. Let's give a warm welcome to Molly Sadler. I said it right. Every year, I've got to make sure I say her name right. So I say it to her at least three or four times, and then Dan Kennedy comes over and says it wrong. Schumer. Schumer. No, not Amy Schumer. You're not competing against Amy Schumer this year. You're competing against Molly Schuyler, the six-time reigning champion, Dan. How does that make you feel? Hungry. Oh, he's hungry. Who else is hungry up here on the dais? Who else is hungry out here in the audience? Well, before we get things started, we're going to bring out our American flag. Our flag, our flag man, Aiden, will be bringing it out right here through the middle, so watch out. Everybody, please remain standing. Remove your hats for the playing of our national anthem by our wonderful jazz and go-go band, Crash Funk Brass. One burger. A pair of threes right here in the middle with Molly and Dan Hillary Kennedy. Andrews at two and a half. Dan Hillary Kennedy and Molly Skyler neck and neck at four to peace. Our 
Brazilian Ricardo Corbucci with three. He's enjoying the severity through out here today. Ricardo Corbucci with six. Dan Killer Kennedy at 11. Molly Skyler at 12. Alex Prescott almost just finishes fourth. Dan Rock has finished fourth.
27 for Molly. Two and a half minutes remain. Two and a half. You can do it, Molly. Ricardo Corbucci with 17. That's about 15 more than I can eat in this amount of time. One minute, one minute remaining in the 12th annual Seaford Independence Club meeting. The French here in DC. Get behind these competitors. Let's make some noise. Holy, holy, holy. Molly with 34, Killer Kennedy with 31, Andrew Cole with 20. Along with Ricardo Corbucci with 20. 8 for Dan Rock, 7 for Alexander Prescott. 16 for Sean the Mouthy Jagger. 8 for Terrence Brown. The final countdown, 15 seconds. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and time is up! All right, they've got to hold it for two minutes. They've got to hold it down. We've got the clock running. Until this is verified by our judges, Molly Schuyler, 36. 32 for Dan the Killer Kennedy. Ricardo Corbucci with 22. Wow, Ricardo, great job. Andrew Poole with 21. Sean the Mouthy Jager, 17. Nine for Dan Rock and Alexander Prescott and Terrence Brown with eight apiece. Let's hear it for these fine contestants up here. That is a health code thing that we want to make sure this city of DC is behind us on this. Let's hear it for our Brazilian over here, Ricardo Corbucci. Thank you for making this international. We've got 30 seconds. Oh, you want to say something, don't you? No, thanks everybody. 
Let's have a round of applause for all of our contestants. Let's show them a little respect today. Gentlemen, we'll be right back in just a few moments with our award presentations. Let's have another round of applause for all of our contestants out here. And of course, all of our scorecard ladies that have been doing a great job making sure that we knew how many they had.
All right, ladies and gentlemen, we have the final numbers. The judges have counted up. They have verified. They have made sure that they went through and made sure all the burgers had been eaten that should have been eaten. So we're going to start with seventh place where we have a two-way tie between two competitors who finished with eight hamburgers each. Alexander Prescott and Terrence Brown. In sixth place with nine burgers consumed, Dan Rock. Jump up and down after eating all those burgers. Ride Metro after eating all those burgers. Finishing in fifth place with 17 hamburgers eaten, eaten Sean the Mouthpiece Jager. And ladies and gentlemen, we have a first in the Z-Burger Independence Burger Eating Contest. We have a tie for the number one spot. Again, these are burgers consumed and the judges went through and looked at the plates to make sure that they had the right amount eaten. They both finished with 34 hamburgers eaten. A tie for first place between Dan the Killer Kennedy and Molly Schuyler. I think they're worn out. I don't know if they could go over time. So Molly, Dan, we're going to come back here with Peter. Molly, you've been the champion here for now seven years, six of those by yourself. How does it feel to share the championship with Dan Killer Kennedy? Wow. Dan, you were throwing that tray, you were throwing those burgers down, and now you're at the top. You're at the upper echelon of the Independence Burger Eating Championship with Molly Schuyler, the six-time reigning champion coming into today. How do you feel? Full. Full. Where's Ricardo? You got it? You got to meet up with Dan Kennedy. He's full. You're not full. So you got to get with him, do some workout before next year. We'll see you back here, right? Yeah, yes, yes sir. <laughs> How's it here again? That's what we like to hear. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> Molly, you want any more hamburgers? Sure. sure, why not? Dan, you want any more hamburgers? Wow, they are ready to go eat some more, aren't they? But this year, they are the 12th Annual Z-Burger Independence Burger Eating Co-Champions. Let's hear it again for Dan Killer Kennedy and Molly Schuyler. All right, now we know that we have some fans out here today. Does anybody have any questions for our competitive eaters up here? Yeah. Just hold your hands up. Can you use ketchup? Do you like to use ketchup? No. Now, Peter likes ketchup. All right, what you got? 
Mustard. What about mustard? Any sort of condiments on there. Oh, Molly's like, no. Molly consumes 34 hamburgers, and you know what? She's like, no way with mustard. All right, right down here. I see you right there. What's your question, sir? Overtime? Yeah. It would have to be an unofficial overtime, though. We, we, we only have six burgers left for both of them. And Peter's like saying, no, grab a couple of those. But we had another question over here. I'm sorry. What did you eat yesterday? Ooh, good question. What did you eat yesterday? Sean, we'll start with you. What did you eat yesterday? Uh, water. That's what. Oatmeal the night before. Oatmeal, water. Andrew? What did you have yesterday? Champions, what did you only eat yesterday? Cheeseburger. Why? I can't. I didn't eat. Actually, I ate a double cheeseburger. Oh, I still get the fries. She ate a double cheeseburger, so Molly wins. No, I'm kidding. All right, Ricardo, you're enjoying the American cuisine. What did you eat yesterday? We went to the Cheesecake Factory and like three hours. Of cheesecake. Went to Cheesecake Factory for a slice of cheesecake. Then he came here and devoured some Z-Burger Z-Burgers. What did you all have to eat yesterday? Uh, down ice cream, lunch pizza. <laughs> Just kidding, right? Okay, what did you really have yesterday? Like cereal. <laughs> Not a whole lot. What about you, Alex Prescott? Salad. Salad. <laughs> what was on the salad? Oh, grilled chicken on the salad, so that's good. So you're enjoying living here in Tumley Town. You decided to come down here to Z Burger and try to devour some hamburger today. Right across the street. So you've been watching from your uh, from your house the last few years, haven't you? And now you're like, yep, I'm going to give it a shot. Well, we'd like to thank everybody for coming out here today. Let's hear from all eight of our contestants. Let us clear up and then we'll tell you when Who wants hamburgers? All right, so we're going to clean up a little bit out here out front to make it safe for everybody. Then we'll invite everybody inside to get your hamburger for being a part of this hamburger eating championship here at Z Burger. Thank you for being here today, everybody. We had a great time having you out here. I'd like to, I'd like to say thank you to the music. Wonderful music. Mr. Peter, you are the great. Thank you, Peter, for this wonderful day. Let's hear it for Peter Tabibian. Peter, come out of here and wave to the crowd once again. Thank you, everybody. Peter brought out Crush Funk as well, so these Crush guys Funk. will play for us a little bit. We'll make sure you get fed with some hot, just for hot dogs. No, hamburgers. Peter's going after the hot dogs. Chocolate shake for my birthday. Chocolate shakes. Well, they have all kinds of shakes here at Sea Burger, so make sure when you head on in, you get something to eat, get something to drink. Again, we're going to be cleaning up out here, so we'll be inviting you in shortly. We thank you for being here, and on behalf of everybody with Z-Burger, with all of our friends that are out here today, I'm DJ Jared Ronski of Metro DC DJs. Thank you, and please drive home safely.